This package gives you an easy way to access MQTT as a client from Unity, so all what you have to do is drag and drop the prefab to your scene. Here we set the host and the port, optionally you can decide if you want to use WebSocket or not. If you want to have encryption, you just can use this TLS checkbox. You can also define if you want to allow untrusted certificates. Optionally you can set a username and password. There's also an automatic reconnect. If the connection to MQTT gets lost, then it will automatically reconnect and resubscribe the topics. Here we have the topics, to which you want to subscribe. You can give a list of topics with wild cards and you can define the quality of service for the subscription. And here we have the status, if the connection should be opened at startup and if it is currently connected. And here we have a reconnect timer, in the case the reconnect is needed. Then we have here Unity events for connection up and connection down, you can add here a custom function to react on this events. And most important if messages arrive, then you can add here a function where you can react on the incoming messages and do whatever you want to do. Of course you can publish data, the MQTT component has a publish function, which is very easy to use, just give the topic in the payload. Payload can be a string or a bytes. Here we have a simple demo of it, where we have a cube and some sliders. The sliders are publishing data to the MQTT broker. On the left side we can set the position, on the right side the rotation. And the cube itself is connected to the arriving messages and will transform to reflect the values of the incoming messages. We see here now this application running two times. These are really two separate running programs, two separate instances of this program. But both are connected to the same central MQTT broker, which can be in the cloud or can run locally. When I now change the values of the topics, then you see both cubes are moving in both applications, because they are connected to the same central MQTT broker. Same can be done with the rotation. That can be achieved very easily with this package, just drag and drop the prefab to your scene set the MQTT broker connection, and then you are ready to subscribe and publish data to MQTT.